I don't really like the South. I mean, it's I know it's the Bible Belt, but it feels like it feels like you're walking on lava. You know, you just know if you say the wrong thing to a certain person, you're like, "Hey, I'm trans." You know, if you take that wrong step, that person will start giving you like dirty looks or rude comments. You know, very few often you'll come across somebody who's like really cool about it. Like, are you trans? Yes, ma'am. Oh, well, that's fabulous. <laughs> you know, and then they relate to some relative or ex-boyfriend or somebody they knew who was gay or trans or something of that nature. You know, it's not like, you know, you live in the northern states. Or, in like California, it, California people wouldn't say much about it. I was like, I'm trans. Cool. And I'm Hank. How's it going? You know. <laughs> but, you know, down here in the South, it, it's different. And it always irritates me that somebody will say stuff like, well, if you don't, particularly down here. I mean, even up north, I've here. I hear it all over the internet when I say I don't like the South. There, somebody would always say, "Well, if you don't like the South, uh, why don't you move?" Because I don't want to. You know, I shouldn't be forced to move to another state or to another country because small, uh, closed-minded people want to accept me for who I am. You know, I shouldn't have to leave the city that I grew up in, the family that I grew up around, the area that I'm familiar with, to go and live in, you know, five, six states away in an environment that I know nothing about. You know, I couldn't leave a small town here and then go and move to... Um, and then go and move to Washington, D.C. You know, I'm not accustomed to 99% of what's going on up there. You know, and I can't, you know, and it's the same thing about people say they live with their parents. You know, people always say, well, well you should move out. Why don't you live on your own? That's easier said than done. Because just like... You know, just like telling somebody, well, if you don't like to self leave, it takes a lot of money to do that. And I mean a lot of money. I mean, to move into an apartment in this town, rent in this town for a one bedroom, one bath apartment is $850. Plus, they need $300 to $500 uh, deposit. And that's just for one person. You're going to have that, you know, thirteen, fifteen hundred, whatever you, you need, money up front. And you got to keep having that much money every day. Then you got to have your uh, lot bill, and then you got to feed yourself. And, you know, good luck trying to get welfare to give you food stamps, you know. So, um, so you know, it's easy to say, well, move. Because you can't afford it, okay? You can't. Sometimes it's a lot easier to go, well, if I live with mom, see, mom has her house, she got her bills, she got a lot bill, her phone bill, she's got rent paid, she got the water and the sewage and the gas or whatever bills your family will have. And all I have to do is just maybe, like, pay a third of the rent instead of all of it. Or a third of half my check and instead of the whole check. That's different. Mm -hmm. And I said, well that's not really that's not really helping. That's not really helping the situation. If I go, well I hate how people down here are kinda closed minded about it, I'll leave. Cause that's letting them win. You know, that's the same as if you got bullied in school, instead of stepping up to him and going, Hey, uh, I don't like this, could you please be a little more kinder towards me? Instead of doing that and going, well, I'm going to go to another school, 
you're going to encounter uh, shit like this everywhere you go. You're going to, you know, if I move to San Francisco, I'm going to come across somebody who's going to be like, oh, you know. So, you know, I'm going to encounter that. So you can't escape idiots. They're going to be always around you. So saying, oh, leave the South and then go somewhere up north. Or go to San Francisco, even. You're not really escaping it. You're just going into a different field. You're just going into a different area where the same sort of people lurk. So, you know, I'm going to stay down here in the South. And if somebody got a problem with it, well, they're just really being an ass about it. And that's my honest opinion. Mm -hmm.